Welcome to our video about describing certain climatic phenomena that occur on a global level. Climate plays a crucial role in shaping our planet's ecology and geography, and it's important to understand the different phenomena that occur on a global scale. So, let's dive in and explore these fascinating and complex climate phenomena. Two of the climatic phenomena that we are going to discuss are climate change and global warming. Let's start with climate change. Climate change is the change in weather patterns that lasts for an extended period of time. It is brought upon by industrialization and emission of greenhouse gases. Greenhouse gases are substances that absorb infrared radiation from the sun and trap the heat in the atmosphere. The absorption of radiation is called greenhouse effect. Some of the gases are water vapor, nitrous oxide, methane, and carbon dioxide. Absence of greenhouse gases will be too cold for human survival, but too much greenhouse gases will be too hot for life. Global warming is a symptom of climate change. Global warming is the increase in the average temperature of Earth's surface. Like climate change, global warming is also caused by greenhouse gases. One evidence of global warming is the melting of glaciers and ice sheets. The Greenland and Antarctic ice sheets have decreased in mass. Data from NASA's gravity recovery and climate experiment show Greenland lost 150 to 250 cubic kilometers, 36 to 60 cubic miles, of ice per year between 2002 and 2006, while Antarctica lost about 152 cubic kilometers, 36 cubic miles, of ice between 2002 and 2005. If melting continuously happens, the global sea level will eventually rise, causing low-lying lands to be submerged in water. As a result, a number of plants, animals, and other organisms will lose their habitats. Here's the summary of the lesson. Climate change is the altered weather patterns observed over a long period of time. Global warming is the increase in average temperature of Earth's surface. Greenhouse gases play a significant role in intensifying climate change and global warming. There will be an evaluation of your understanding of the lesson. Are you ready? Let's start. Modified true or false, identify which among the given statements are true and or false. 1. Climate change is the change in weather patterns within a day. 2. Climate change is due to the movement of the Earth's crust. A. Statement 1 is true. Statement 2 is false. B. Statement 1 is false. Statement 2 is true. C. Both statements 1 and 2 are true. D. Both statements 1 and 2 are false. The correct answer is D. Both statements 1 and 2 are false. Multiple choice, select the correct answer. Which of the following is not a greenhouse gas? A. Nitrous oxide. C. Water vapor. B. Carbon dioxide. D. Nitrogen. The correct answer is D, nitrogen. Multiple choice, select the correct answer. Which of the following is true about the greenhouse gases? A. They help in trapping the heat from the sun in the atmosphere. B. In their absence, the earth will be too hot for life. C. Too much greenhouse gases will make the earth extremely cold. D. All statements are true. The correct answer is A. Greenhouse gases help in trapping the heat from the sun in the atmosphere. Multiple choice, select the correct answer. Which of the following is true about global warming? A. It is the increase in temperature of the Earth's core. B. It is the increase in the average temperature of the Earth's surface. C. 
It is caused by the depletion of greenhouse gases. D. All statements are not true. The correct answer is B. Global warming is the increase in the average temperature of the Earth's surface. Multiple choice, select the correct answer. Which of the following is an evidence of global warming? A. Rapid freezing of water in the ocean. B. Decrease in body temperature of humans. C. Decrease in mass of ice sheets in Antarctica. D. Condensation of greenhouse gases. The correct answer is C. Decrease in mass of ice sheets in Antarctica. How many correct answers did you get? If you got all correct answers you are doing great. If you got some incorrect answer, don't worry, you can rewatch this video to review in which question did you get wrong. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell, so you never miss a new video. Also, feel free to leave a comment down below with any feedback or suggestions for future videos. I appreciate your support, and I'll see you in the next one.